What's up guys, today we're going to be reacting to your mom actually on the latest video and let my guy roommates choose my outfit So if you guys do like this video, make sure you subscribe and yeah man, let's get into it Hello and welcome back to matching with my roommates for a week I've already matched with two of my roommates So if you guys haven't watched that video yet, you better go watch it It's with Kelly and Anne-Marie And so in today's video, of course, I will be matching with Elliot and Luke I am so freaking I'm looking excited. forward to this Both one because these two really well in my opinion. I mean, they've got so different dress senses I'm so. between them. Between them Go best friends, Elliot and Mr. Mm -hmm. Luke I'm winning Period. Uh, Luke has really laid back style, but I always say I love his style. He's yeah. always got like the baggy pants, nice sweatshirt. Bro, Amer <laughs> why do Americans, why did, Mer bro, Americans wear such baggy clothes, bro? I don't understand. I mean, it's fashion, but like still like, I don't know who goes out the way to, to buy clothes that don't fit them, bro. That just don't make sense. That's what I look like the whole day and you guys didn't I haven't seen, me. look, you know, I haven't seen a lot of people wear baggy clothes recently in this, you know what I mean? Yeah, or this this period of or well, this decade you know what i mean i don't know what i'm trying to say but all i'm trying to say is he goes out to buy baggy clothes i don't know and then elliot elliot always I mean, has some style. super nice pieces and i feel like i know his style really Look, well so what i'm gonna do in today's video time, is i'm bro. going to it's predict so what he's gonna wear and attempt to just match with him right, by just guessing okay. what he's wearing so without further ado let's go check on elliot <laughs> Today I am dressing as none other than Elliot Choi. Can you guys tell? I got on his little copyright hoodie. There's some navy blue cargos. No back pocket, which has me kind of dead, but that's fine. I actually have no idea what Elliot is wearing today, but I'm just hoping that he's wearing something like this. This is like his most like signature outfit. So right now I'm just waiting for him to come home and we'll see if he's wearing a matching outfit. Let's pray. <laughs> Is he? Wow, he is as well. Nice outfit. Like yeah, he wears jacket. that all the time, I like bro. Your bro, is that Andrew's jacket or is like I don't understand, bro. I don't know, bro. I don't. Let me know in the comments down below because I feel like that's Andrew's jacket because the last video I watched of Ashley's, not the last video but the video before that, she said, you know what I mean. Luke wearing that jacket reminded her of Andrew, so I'm confused, bro. And, and like Kelly wears outfit. a jacket as well, so <laughs> I feel like this shirt, but okay, I don't know. Bro. I'm like confused. Me. No, you look like me. No, you look like me. No, you look like me. No, look, like me. look at these pants. They're like sick. yeah. I was like praying that you're wearing these pants today because wow, I wasn't me. sure if you were gonna. I feel like this, this just means I wear the same thing every day. Yeah. <laughs> I like the traveling jacket. Everyone yeah, wears yeah. the jacket. That's very nice. I saw it from Kelly, but it's Ashley. Yeah. <laughs> what do you think of our outfits, See? Luke? Looks good. Same sweatshirt. Same. Copyright. Pants, same okay. Shoes, okay. Same yeah. You can call me a trendsetter. I try my best. Oh my god, I do need glasses. <gasps> oh, oh yeah, is that you? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I think the jackets ruin it though. I feel like she can't take off the jacket because it's cold in New York. But I feel like if she would have took off the jacket and he would have took off the jacket, I feel like it would have made it a lot better. So. Elliot, I have a surprise for what? you. Mm. Surprise! And I just realized it's been in my pocket and I totally forgot. But I have this. What is that? Oh, oh, right nice. Nice. oh okay. I actually love these. Yeah, they're really they good. <laughs> is it true? <laughs> Okay. Oh my gosh, what did I just say, bro? I said, oh my god, no way did I just say it was fruit. Oh my gosh, bro, I'm sorry. <laughs> I just said it was fruit. I mean, bro, I hey, keep pausing it as well, bro. Wearing our matching outfits, gonna take a little venture into the city. Mad. Mini so. You want the big penguin? Yeah, yeah. Okay. You could hide a whole person in there. Open it. Open it. Stick another plushie in the hole. I bet it's stuffed with like. <laughs> oh my That's gosh, so funny. Bro. I think we should pick out plushies for each other. Should I find one that matches your personality? Yeah, and I'll find one for you. Uh, I decided I'll get you this one. I love it. It's so fluffy. <laughs> this one's for you. I love it. Sheer. That is actually the cutest thing ever. Ready? Yes. <gasps> it's literally me. What's his name? Um, Rick. <laughs> Rick? Yeah, Rick. I like you're it. You're athletic, so. Oh, thank you, Elliot. Athlete, Aww. cheerleader, dog. This is you. <laughs> hi, guys. What's your name? I love, I'm Ivy. Yay, thank you for saying hi. hi. Yo, the fans, yo, guys, if you see me out in public, don't be afraid to say hi, you get me? I don't really go out anyways, but like, when I do, you get me? And if you guys are watching this on the channel, you know what I mean? You know what to do, you know what, you know what I mean? You know what to do, you know what to... 
Ah, you know, just carry up. I was gonna say something crazy, but like, I tried to say something that rhymed, but didn't work. You're the only one I know that wears plushies as accessories. Every day, it's a daily wear. Yeah, he does wear this on the wrist. Uh, you are. Thanks for the bracelet, Ashley. Of course. Spending off their money, mate. Elliot is currently trying on some clothes. I had to leave because I have to go pee really bad. It's like a constant issue for me where like I always have to go pee. So while he's in the dressing room, I'm looking for a bathroom. I know there's always a bathroom in the real real, so that's where I always go to the bathroom if I'm in Soho with my little life hack. I forget what other stores have bathrooms, but I can always count on the real real man. Anyways, I feel like all of us have such conflicting schedules. It's actually really nice. Obviously, like I had to like schedule in this time with Elliot to be like, we're gonna go shopping in Soho, but it's really good to spend some more one-on-one one time with Elliot because I feel like we all kind of operate as like a group unit like we all always go everywhere together here we are the store that I use as a bathroom guys you guys have no idea how amazing it is to me to find public restrooms in your city so <laughs> this is great just kidding I'm back I went pee Elliot came out of the store got a bag oh yeah back on the streets of Soho so I'm taking Elliot to a surprise location that I keep getting Instagram ads for, so oh, like really? I'm like I want to go there. Yeah, they're the, targeting you. The Instagram ad targeted me successfully. <laughs> Look, Elliot. Oh, Elliot owns that truck. My daddy owns that truck. <laughs> I think I see it. Lazy <laughs> Sundays. Lazy Sundays. Bro, these guys go everywhere, bro. I ain't got the money though. We are eating. <laughs> Elliot got a white peach tea. I think. Yeah, I will do, dog. Thank you. Which is like shaved ice with matcha and like a lot of toppings. That looks good. Cheers. <laughs> show Emery and Luke my plushie. They already see the pineapple plushie. Very cute. This one is the one that Elliot got me. Oh, oh yeah. Elliot loves the plushies the most out of anyone that I know. <laughs> uh, <laughs> yeah, whatever. I'm nice. a sucker for plushies. Get out of here. <laughs> now, let's pretend that this is a separate day. I know I'm trying to do this video for a week, but I got limited days here, guys, before I go on a little trip to California. So I really want to match with Luke. I see the outfit that he's wearing right now, so I'm gonna just totally match it. And we're gonna hang out with Luke for the rest of the night. Uh, he's wearing some little sweatpants, some black sweatpants, and a beige sweatshirt. So I'm gonna go grab a beige sweatshirt from my closet. I'm gonna be twinning with him. Sweatpants? I actually think these might be Luke's sweatpants. I literally just took them out of his They look big, bro. Sweatshirt. I'm fully dressed as Luke. This is so funny. I'm gonna go out there and this will be his exact outfit. I wanna see what he's wearing, to be honest with you. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Get to what I'm dressed as. Oh! Yeah! I wear that every single day. Yeah! Wow! Wait, where, wait what are those? Nothing, man! What are those? This is actually really close. Anne Marie like did that to Luke, wrong. bro. <laughs> Anne Marie took Luke on a date. He spent a lot of money on her. You know what I mean? She was like, yeah, go get your nails painted. And then he did, and then she didn't do it. I was so, bro. You can't necklace. let her back now, nah, bro. It's actually pretty similar. Too. I don't feel like guys should have their nails painted, to be honest, man. You know what I mean? Comment down below on your thoughts and, you know what I mean, what you think about that. To me personally, I would never get it done. But, hey. I was like, oh, I got the same chains. We're going to go to Chinatown now. Period. They really do look like, bro. I'm going to lean into one hip and, like, mm, three, two, one. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so currently I'm out with Luke. We are going into Chinatown because I really want to go to like, they have like little like fruit market areas where they like sell fruit for a really good price. And I'm gonna teach Ashley a skateboard trick. You should do one right now across the this street. This is what I'll teach you. It's, okay. it's a hit or miss, it's all Okay, about. okay. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, oh, we're done. oh that we're was done. close now. At first I thought it was joking the way it didn't bounce up, but. I'll teach you. It's, okay. it's a hit or miss. It's all Okay, about. okay. <laughs> oh, one more time, one more time. Oh, nice. Yeah, that was cool, man. There's definitely a lot of fruits around here that I feel like I've never seen before. So I'm very excited. This is apparently what a guava looks like. I've never seen a guava. guava. Neither has Luke. Oh, I really want to get one of these later. What Dragon is... fruit, just because they look pretty. The mangoes. I think that's a papaya. Star apple. Oh, let's make a you 
like Asian pears, oh, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, these are very good. It's called the pomelo. It's like a grapefruit. Fruit ball. <laughs> yeah, I found a nice alleyway now on the way home to practice the skateboard tricking. Basically, all you gotta do is yeah. you throw it, then you jump on it, you throw it down backwards, it's like this way. Okay, all luck. Oh, nice! I'm gonna use the Elliot technique. If you don't land this, you will die. This is for your life. Oh man. You died. <laughs> She's just bashing at that board, bro. She's flinging at that, mate. Oh, oh, oh. I counted. I counted. I count it. She was a skater girl. 10 out of 10. Thank you. Thank you, Luke, for teaching me my first ever skating trick. <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> so I like your board. Thank you. Bowl, which signals to me that Luke likes fruit. Oh, that is some of the fruit we got. We found a weird little place. It's like so random. It's in what the middle of an alleyway. Luke is obsessed is with the this? dragon fruit. It looks so cool, but it's like, I think you can't eat this. It looks poisonous. It looks poisonous? Yeah, we will find out. We'll find out. Fruit time. Okay. <laughs> I should wash these. Luke is obsessed with this one. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna start with the up. mango because this one is nice and easy, I think. Oh, oh yeah, look at that. Mm. Wow, that's I love this music, man. Okay, mango. Yeah. It's pretty good. That's bomb. It's a good mango. I've had these ones before. They're like really smooth. He's digging in. <laughs> Mangoes are fire. I'm reading out of 10. Mm -hmm. Nine. Nice. I nice kind of am leaning towards this next. Another spoon fruit. Is the there a seed? pit? Whoa. What is it? <gasps> I like thought it was an alien. <laughs> nah, I'm joking, but it looked bad. The another thing that jumped fruit. out, mate. Is there a pit? Whoa, what is <gasps> Look, it just, you know like me? Squid. It kind of looks funny still. Okay, you want me to just try it first? Yeah. It's like a seed. Luke never tries. Wait, maybe I shouldn't eat that. <laughs> I think you take out the seed. Oh, that makes sense. Honestly, that's pretty good. I like it, actually. I do like it. What's it taste like? It actually kind of tastes like a persimmon. Don't eat the seed. A persimmon? What's next. that? Uh. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> bro, this guy does not like nothing, bro. I'm telling you. It's like another fruit. It makes like a white. Yeah. Oh, God. Mm -mm. That's so awkward. <laughs> I give it a four out of ten. Four out of ten. Tastes okay. Tastes good, but look. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Maybe we'll try the guafa next. Excuse me, buddy. <laughs> oh. Whoa! A guava's white? I didn't even know that. Well, we'll try it. I guess, yeah, try to spoon it. It might be too hard. Ooh, nice. <laughs> oh my god, that sounds so crunchy. You know. It's like an apple. I don't know, it just like tastes like nothing. It's kind of spongy in the middle. Bro. What is it called? Oh, Rubicon. If you never tried Rubicon guava, you gotta try it, bro. It's the finest drink ever, bro. Rubicon gro- Rubicon guava, yeah. Try it if you haven't. It's so nice. Ew, they don't like I it. I actually don't like this. The drink's because nice. Elliot I don't know how to make the drink because the drink's purple, the mate. Sir. So I don't know what to put in there. are coming because the guava tastes so bad. <laughs> I like it. This is a pear. This is a guava. It tastes like a green pear. I had the, the inside of this one is mushy. Do you want to try it? The inside of this one? No. <laughs> mushy bite. <laughs> yeah, I that still one's probably this one's gone the off. Out of all of them, though. Maybe like a three out of ten. <laughs> Your favorite one. <gasps> Whoa! <laughs> oh, I heard, I heard this fruit just doesn't taste of anything. I heard it's horrible. So let's see that reaction. Next. It looks like a pineapple mixed with Oreos, a uh, cookies and cream pineapple. Let's do it with a spoon. This one gotta be ten out of ten. Have yeah. you ever had this before? Mm -mm. Really? I heard it's horrible. <laughs> Is it actually good? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Bro, no, bro, what is going on? The one thing that I've heard people hate because it doesn't taste of anything, he likes it, bro. Yeah, this guy, bro, I don't know if I've- this before? He really? He, bro. Is it actually good? It must taste Yay. nice, bro, because he hates everything. It must taste yeah, nice. I've had it before and it's been like kind of watery, but maybe- It's like a kiwi. Really? Oh, 
Oh, this one is actually really good. I've had dragon fruit before, and actually, this one's like the best dragon fruit I ever had. This might be my new favorite fruit. Mmm. This is actually really good. I'm gonna have to try it's it now. Cool, now that Luke says it's cool. What do you rate this one out of 10? I'm gonna 9.8. 9.8. Yeah. Wow. That's maybe the highest we'll get tonight. Very nice rating. I was gonna say 10 out of 10. I wonder what a real what would a real 10 out of 10 be. We still have the other dragon fruit. <laughs> this one might look the same. Whoa. That's a lot more, isn't it? Isn't the color so pretty? That's so cool. I'll try a little bite first. We'll see. Looks like ice cream. Oreo ice cream. It looks... Yeah, that one's bad. No. That one's worse. Oh, man, compared to this one, this one is like... Is it the same... So it's the same fruit or is it not? Because they say it's the same, like but I don't know. Three out of ten. Three out of ten. Yeah. Wow. That's a I big difference it's... between the yes. two dragon okay. fruit. This is our last one. It's what is that? Huge papaya. Papaya. Uh, there's so like much. That head. looks like a melon, bro. <laughs> is this huge I don't know. Papaya? There's so much fruit in the world, man. Like Why would fruit, man? <laughs> I don't know about the seeds, though, bro. Them like seeds look nice. Like... This one smells like... so, mm, so bad. Are yeah. you serious? It smells like a rat cage. Did you ever have rats? No, but my friend did, and I hated the smell. Ooh, this is a big bite. It's good. It's a good papaya. Your turn. What does it taste what you, like? What do you rate it? Mmm. Actually, like I like the papaya, but then something Kelly told me about papayas makes oh, me not like them. Oh, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> it literally smells how it tastes. Yeah. <laughs> You're just eating an edible rat cage. See, you see what I said about? You see? You really crazy. You see what I said about? You don't like nothing. Yo. <laughs> really? <laughs> Kelly told me to him papaya tastes like throw up. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> 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 and now, like every time I eat it, I'm just like, ugh. Zero. So this is least favorite, all the way to most favorite. Amazing. Mm. Thanks, Luke. We have finished our fruit taste test. Let's go. Yes. Alrighty, guys. That brings me to the end of today's video, and also the end of my little matching with my roommate series. If you guys want to see any other videos about clothes or outfits, just let me know down in the comments. I would love to know. And yeah, thanks again for watching. Love you guys, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye. Bye. <laughs> you know what? Yeah. I commented on her subscribe thing one time. I was like, she missed the E, but I understand why she still does that now. So, I mean, I guess it's all right. But yeah, that was, that was actually, oh, I did react to this video and I have reacted to this video. So if you guys do want to check them out, you know what I mean? They'll probably, if you go to my videos page, they'll probably be there. But um, yeah, this has been your girl, Ashley, your mom, Ashley anyways. And um, yeah, this was, part two of the video i reacted to before but i feel like i like this video because i feel like they did a bit more but um i did like how they tried the fruits because you know what i mean there's a lot of fruits in the world i hardly knew about the ones they tried so it was good to know you know what i mean but yeah so yeah if you guys do want to see some more your mom ashley videos um reactions anyways make sure you smash the like button make sure you subscribe and um, yeah it's been your boy monta Lewis, and i'll catch you in the next one bye